All right. Well, thank you, everybody, for getting together with us. This is a special chapel today. Um, so as we, as we gather together, we're going to get ready to pray together before we open our Senior Awards Chapel. Just a few words about this. Uh, to the seniors, we want to say, um, for the first time of many times, we will say this till graduation, thank you for being a part of Dayton Christian. Uh, your hard work, your dedication, your excellence, the things that you've put in to school, to sports, to fine arts, are going to start to be recognized in a specific way today, and then we'll carry on into this evening as the Fine Arts Awards are giving uh, themselves later tonight. Uh, today we will also be recognizing students in other classes that have excellence in athletics or academics as well. So if you would pray with me to open our awards chapel, and to all the students here, we want to say thank you to you as well for all you're putting in to the end of this school year. Heavenly Father, we thank you for this time. We thank you for each student that's gathered. For those who will be recognized today, we want to honor them for the hard work and dedication that they've given. For all the students here, God, we thank you for everything that they placed into their schoolwork, into their athletic endeavors, into their artistic talents and execution there. God, we pray that uh, we would honor them as we honor you. And Lord, we thank you for the teachers that are gathered as well. Uh, those that will present and those that teach uh, so well each day in the classroom. God, we thank you for this place where we can gather in your name. And we ask that you would allow us, Lord, to honor you in this time and to present you uh, to the world as we present you to one another today in this place. In Christ's name, amen. At this time, I'm going to ask Mrs. Hendricks to come up. If you'll give her a round of applause for all she does for us. Thank you. Good morning. We are going to begin by recognizing our graduates in groups. Our first group is going to be with the last name letter A through B. So when I call your name, if you'll please stand in your place. And if you'll hold all the applause till the end of the group, that would be awesome. Zoe Adams, Cedarville University. <laughs> Luke Alexander, Sinclair Community College. Peter Allen, University of Kentucky. Gabby Barkas, Bowling Green State University. Noah Berna, Sinclair Community College. Elijah Blackshear first starting at Sinclair and then moving on to Central State University. Brianna Blake, Wright State University. Isabel Blatz, University of the Cumberlands. James Broughton, Liberty University. Julia Broughton, Liberty University. Evan Brown, Liberty University. Nicholas Brown, University of Cincinnati. Ethan Buchert, Lighthouse Electric. Bethany Burkhart, Lipscomb University, and Sydney Butler, Central Michigan. <laughs> now Mr. Miner is going to come up and recognize some of his excellent science students and uh, recognize them for their efforts in science fair. Thank you. For years, uh, Dayton Christian School has had students uh, do science fair projects and go on to Montgomery County Science Day, West District Science Fair, and then State Science Day. And those are through the Ohio Academy of Science. Over the years, Dayton Christian's had 16 students make it all the way to the International uh, Science Engineering Fair. This year, Dayton Christian had 130 students that did science fair projects. Um, we had 16 of those that went on to district, and the, today what I uh, uh, want to do is recognize those that are made it all the way to state. And so as I call their name, if you'll just stand, and again, if you'll hold your applaud till the end. So Rhett Bailey, Emma Brown, Kara Dashwich, Beckett DeBusk, Caitlin Halter, Sam uh, uh, Hendricks, who's that? Sam Hendricks. <laughs> um, uh, and, and Avi 
whatever his last name is, <laughs> and Seth Thompson. So those are our students that are made it to state. Good morning, Warriors. At this time, I'd like to present our five pages of athletic awards, all right? So we got some good stuff here this morning, okay? Um, some of these awards we want to make sure we hold our applause for until we get through the end of them. So we'd like to start today with our athletic awards by re-recognizing our student athletes who have um, committed to compete at the next level. Last Wednesday, we had a, uh, an awesome signing ceremony um, in the Warrior Center that uh, was just a great, um, a great community effort there and fellowship that we had recognizing our seniors who are going on to compete at the next level with family, friends, teachers, and um, other um, alumni. So um, with that, I want to recognize our eight um, student athletes who have signed to participate next year at the college level. First, we have Ryan Edgerton of Owens Community College. He will play baseball. Elisa James at Ohio Wesleyan University to run track. Holly Garrett will be attending Anderson University to play women's soccer. Isabel Blatz will attend the University of the Cumberlands to run cross country and track. Lauren Collins will attend Taylor University to play women's soccer. Madeline Keenan, who's actually on the tennis court right now, uh, participating in the sectional um, state tournament, will attend Cedarville University to play tennis. Kayla Ogburn will attend Taylor University to play soccer. And Evan Demaray will attend Calvin University to play basketball. So congratulations to these athletes. Next, the athletic department would like to recognize our students who have received four varsity letters um, in their respective sport. So these are four-year varsity letter winners um, in their respective sport. And some of our athletes today that we're going to recognize are two- or three-year, four-year varsity letter winners. So pretty, pretty high achievement here. Um, obviously, they, we have certain criteria for each sport to be a varsity letter winner. So each of these students have met that criteria to receive a varsity letter letter. Um, starting with their freshman year, going all the way through this year as, as seniors. So um, when I recognize you, these are in alphabetical order. Please come forward. We have a special plaque or, or award here for you um, that you can receive from Mrs. Blatz. All right? Um, let's begin. Luke Alexander, four-year varsity letter winner and boys soccer. Gabby Barkus, four-year varsity letter winner, volleyball. Brianna Blake, four-year varsity letter winner, track and field. Isabel Blatz, four years varsity letter winner in track and field and cross country. Evan Brown, four-year varsity letter winner in boys soccer. Nick Brown, four-year varsity letter winner, track and field. Sydney Butler, four years, varsity cheerleading. Lauren Collins, four year, varsity letter winner, girls soccer. Sia Cron, four year, varsity letter winner in track and field. Sophia Cron, four year, varsity letter winner in track and field as well. Chloe Dickerson, four-year varsity letter winner in cheerleading. Cameron Dudley, four-year varsity letter winner, boys track and field. Aaron Ebert, four-year varsity letter winner in both cross country and swimming. Holly Garrett, four-year varsity letter winner, girls soccer. Nathaniel Geis, four-year varsity letter winner, three sports, cross country, swimming, and boys track and field. <laughs> Zai Zane Holiday, four-year varsity letter winner in volleyball and track and field. <laughs> Alicia James, four-year varsity letter winner in soccer and track and field. Elijah Joyce, four years in swimming. <laughs> Madeline Keenan, four-year varsity letter winner, soccer, swimming, and tennis. <laughs> Bailey Peterson, four years varsity letter winner, cheerleading, and girls basketball. 
Madison Pullen, four-year varsity letter winner in volleyball and softball. Martina Pullen, four-year varsity letter winner in softball. Sam Reynolds, four-year varsity letter winner cross country, swimming, and track and field. Jenna Schubert, four-year varsity letter winner cross, or sorry, no, excuse me, soccer and track and field. <laughs> Rebecca Scugins, varsity letter winner, four years swimming and track and field. <laughs> and Silas Thompson, four-year varsity letter winner, boys tennis. <laughs> Congratulations to all of our four-year varsity letter winners. Great job. Okay, at this time, I'd like to recognize our Ohio High School Athletic Association Scholar Athlete Award. This award encourages and recognizes achievement in the classroom as well as on the playing surface. We would like to recognize, this award recognizes some of the state's top scholar athletes with this award and is awarded to the senior students with the highest scholastic average at the end of the first semester. This recipient must have received a minimum of four varsity letters in any sports combined. This year's OHSA Scholar Athlete Award goes to Sam Reynolds with a GPA of 4.41. And Sophia Cron with a GPA of 4.39. Congratulations. If you guys can get a picture over here real quick in front of the front of the screen. At this time, I'm going to have our athletic assistant, Mrs. Blatz, come up and recognize our next few award winners. Mrs. Blatz. As an ongoing part of the program from OHSAA, they want to promote sportsmanship, ethics, and integrity. They recognize students who, ex who display excellent sportsmanship. This award is named for Archie Griffin, a two-time recipient of the Heisman Trophy for football and who displayed excellent sportsmanship. This year, the Dayton Christian Athletic Department would like to present the OHSAA Archie Griffin Sportsman Award to Darren Swift and Kayla Ogburn. Our next award is for the National Award of Excellence. The National Federation of High Schools has presented each OHSA high school who is a member of the OHSA to present an award for excellence. This is an award that, um, to a person who displays excellent sportsmanship, ethics, and integrity. This award is presented to senior students in our school who have displayed these qualities and who embody good sportsmanship, good citizenship, good moral character, and good sporting behavior. Individuals who are in a positive role model for others and they encourage others to be positive role models. The NFHS National Award of Excellence for 2021 has been awarded to Jenna Schubert, Madison Pullen, and William Cron.
Next is our Dayton Christian Athletics Shield Award. This award is um, presented by our athletic department in recognition of one male and one female student athlete who exhibit total release and performance, spiritual leadership, academic, academic effort, attitude, and athletic ability. The recipients of this award have their names engraved on a plaque that is displayed in the athletic wing of our building. This year, it is my honor to recognize Nathaniel Geis and Brianna Blake as our winners. Thank you, Mrs. Blatz. At this time, uh, I'd like to recognize the National Interscholastic Athletic Administrators Association, which recognizes athletes who have participated in three sports or three sports seasons throughout this academic year. Additionally, these students that, um, that we um, will name off here are also, some of them are our Dayton Christian Iron Award winners, which means a student must have received all A's and B's on the report card throughout the entire year this year. So we have quite the list here, great achievement here of our three sports student athletes, which shows a lot of, uh, just a lot of dedication to Dayton Christian Athletics, going from one sport to another, three sports throughout the year. Um, somebody that's really committed to our school and our school athletic programs, and also if you're an Iron Award winner, you've received all A's and B's on your report card throughout the entire academic year. So congratulations to these award winners, if you'd come up and receive your awards when we call your name. All right, Luke Alexander. Abram Bailey, <laughs> Rhett Bailey, <laughs> Brianna Blake, <laughs> Isabel Blatz, <laughs> Lauren Collins, <laughs> Yamaya Craver. Josie Fair, Isabella Fairman, Nathaniel Geis, Sam Reynolds, you guys can hold your applause maybe until we're finished here, okay, that way we can hear, hear names. Paige Heinrich. We'll give one, one round of applause at the end. Tristan Hill, Zizane Holiday, Madeline Keenan, Andrew Keenan, Claire McComas. Again, all these student athletes are three sport student athletes during this current school year. Justin Oliver, Bailey Peterson, Sophie Poindexter, Martina Pullen, Kaylee Redman, Nathaniel Reynolds, Sam Reynolds, Logan Rimkus, Esther Ross, Aurora Schubert, Alina Sequist, Mila Seifquist, Avery Schick, Jenna Schubert, Rebecca Scugins, Wesley Taylor, Kylie Toll, Katie Walker, Ethan Withers, and Brady Woodall. Now, let's give them all a round of applause. Congratulations.
right, our next award here today is an award that the Ohio High School Athletic Association allows us to give out. It's called the Courageous Student Award. This award recognizes a student in each high school that has overcome serious illness, injury, or disability. They have overcome great adversity in a positive way. The student has gone far beyond normal in assisting their fellow students, a family member, or friend. This student has displayed tremendous courage against overcoming overwhelming odds, and this award is intended to bring credit to this individual who has been involved in or supportive of the interscholastic athletic programs here at Dayton Christian and who, recon who deserves recognition for their tremendous courage. You guys can hold your round of applause until I'm uh, finished reading the description here. This year, we'd like to present the Ohio High School Athletic Association Courageous Student Award to Evan Demaray. Okay, Evan has defied all odds and has found success playing basketball here at Dayton Christian. At the young age of 12, he was diagnosed with Leber's um, neuropathy disease, and it's a rare form of an eye disease that would rapidly take away his vision. Evan did not let that stop him, and he trusted the Lord um, for his plan in his life and showed tremendous courage as he walked through this path. His passion has always been for the game of baseball, but the Lord had other plans for him. Evan found the game of basketball and went after it with all heart, effort, and soul. He worked to make our varsity team here at Dayton Christian and was also a, a starting member on a local AAU basketball team. He found himself ex excelling on the basketball court, and he attacks life like he plays basketball, never giving up with everything that he has. He is an inspiration to his teammates, coaches, his teachers, and his family and friends. As we know, Evan will attend Calvin University next year on a basketball scholarship, and we are proud of you, Evan, and, and as you're a true inspiration to us in the, and as you represent the Ohio High School Athletic Association in this Courageous Student Award. Evan Demaray. Okay, next part of our program here, we're going to move into our scholarships. Um, the first scholarship we'd like to announce is the Kingdom Community Foundation Award Scholarship. Um, we're a partner with the uh, Kingdom Sports Center down um, I-75 here, close by. Um, they're a great facility for us as we um, host a lot of practices and games there, so they're a great partner. Um, as a result, they like to um, bless our student athletes with this scholarship. So in, in memory of H. Raymond Rowe, this scholarship is on behalf of Kingdom Community Foundation. This award is being presented to students based on their scholastic achievements, athletic abilities, and most importantly, for being an outstanding role model to their fellow classmates at Dayton Christian. This is a $300 scholarship that can be used on your future educational pursuits or other, um, other needs. This year's Kingdom Foundation Scholarship Award winners are Zai Zane Holiday and Nathaniel Geis. Congratulations. <laughs> Next part of our program, we're going to have Mrs. Kelly Collins come forward. She's our Athletic Booster Club member, and she is going to present our Booster Scholarships and our Rebecca Winslow Spirit Award. So, Mrs. Collins. Hi there. So, the Rebecca Winslow um, Scholarship was established to honor the, the memory of Rebecca Winslow, who was tragically killed in a car accident in October um, of 2007. Rebecca was a varsity soccer player who was insp an inspiration to all who she encountered. She was the smallest person on the soccer team with one of the biggest hearts. Her positive outlook and dedication were not only demonstrated on the field, but it carried over to her school, community, and church. She loved the Lord and she loved to serve. This award is presented annually to a Dayton Christian senior athlete who is nominated by their coach um, and given to the Winslow family to read and um, choose. This year, it's my honor to present the Rebecca Winslow Spirit Award to Madeline Keenan. <laughs> Madeline is not here. She's playing tennis, so we'll make sure she gets the scholarship. Um, the other scholarships that the boosters fund are the four um, athletic scholarships. Seniors are um, asked to write an essay, write two essays, one on their spiritual leadership, and how they have um, contributed to the, to the community, 
and the other is how they've been um, how the impact of Dayton Christian spiritual environment has impacted their life. Um, these essays are sent out to an independent panel that is within the community um, and brought back to the boosters. They are also put down all of their athletic achievements over the four years here at Dayton Christian. This year's award winners are Isabel Blatz, Luke Alexander, Kayla Ogburn, and Lauren Collins. At this time, it's my honor to now recognize graduates with the last name C through F. Students, please stand when your name is called. Please hold all applause until the last name is called. First up, Christopher Chadwick, Sinclair Community College. Please hold applause. Next, Chen Jerry Chen, Miami University. Lauren Collins, Taylor University. Faith Conover, Taylor University. Emma Cook, Sinclair Community College. Anastasia Cron, Ohio State University. Sophia Cron, Ohio State University. William Cron, Boston College. Jake Deason, Wright State University. Evan Demeray, Calvin University. Chloe Dickerson, Olivet University. Cameron Dudley, Belmont University. Aaron Ebert, Sinclair Community College. Ryan Edgerton, Owens Community College, Maria Fleetwood, Georgian Court University. Please give them a round of applause. <laughs> the following students are Montgomery County residents and each have been awarded a renewable scholarship totaling $5,000 per academic year. As your name is announced, students, please come forward to receive your certificate for this valued scholarship. First up, receiving the Dayton Montgomery Community, or I'm sorry, Dayton Montgomery County Scholarship Program Award is Zoe Adams, Cedarville University. Our next award winner is Sydney Butler, University of Cincinnati. And our third scholarship award winner is Bailey Peterson, The Ohio State University. We will now recognize graduates with last names G through L. Students, please stand when your name is called and hold your applause to the end. Holly Garrett, Anderson University. Nathaniel Geis, Liberty University. Sophia Grant, Cedarville University. Julia Hahn, Indiana Wesleyan University. Tina He, Syracuse University. Andrew Heinrich, Cedarville University. Zai Holiday, Ohio State University. Caitlin Horton, Cedarville University. Spencer Jackson, Midtown Auto Center. Alisa James, Ohio Wesleyan University. Clark Johnson, Miami University, Oxford. Elijah Joyce, University of Oklahoma. Madeline Keenan, Cedarville University. Ethan Keister, Sinclair Community College to follow on to University of Cincinnati. Caleb Kirk, Ohio University. Joshua Kitchens, Sinclair Community College. Emma Lacey, Southern Adventist University. Sarah Lee, Sinclair Community College. Jaden Literal, Cedarville University. 
Benjamin Ludi Sinclair Community College. Mr. Miner is going to come back up again and present a special award. So in the state of Ohio, students are, are asked to uh, compete for a scholarship uh, at Ohio State University, and it's a STEM award, uh, Science, Technology, Engineering, Mathematics, sponsored by Honda. And our Dayton Christian senior this year, who excelled in the area of science, was nominated for the Ohio State Award and the Honda STEM Partnership. Our own Barry Chen was chosen to represent Dayton Christian for this prestigious award, which is also eligible to receive up to a $3,000 scholarship at Ohio State University. Jerry, if you come get your award. time we are going to be presenting many students with certificates of achievement in the areas of academics, fine arts, athletics, leadership, and Christian service from ACSI. Please come forward when your name is called and claim your certificate. Please hold all applause to the end. Gracie Atkins, Gracie Allen, Brett Bailey, Gabby Barkas, Brianna Blake, James Broughton, Julia Broughton, Emma Brown, Faith Conover, Sia Cron, Sophia Cron, Will Cron, Olivia Dabbled, Chloe Dickerson, Josie Fair, Nathaniel Geis, Julia Hahn, Caitlin Halter, Natalie Hayward, Samuel Hendricks, Caitlin Horton, Haley Jankard, Madeline Keenan, Nathaniel Matthew, Tiffany McAfee, Luke McCarty, Eleanor McDaniel, Grace Miller, Gretchen Milhouse, Isabel Nixon, Addie Ogburn, Kayla Ogburn, Kaylee Redman, Luke Reed, Samuel Reynolds, Audrey Riesbeck, Esther Ross, Avi Sakta Kamaran, Josie Skolik, Addie Smith, Gabe Smith, Isabel Thompson, Seth Thompson, Kylie Toll, and Brady Woodall. At this time, it's my honor to present our graduates from the class of 2021 in the letters M through T. Please hold your applause until all have been called. First up, we have Eleanor McDaniel, Ohio State University, Elena Miller, University of Cincinnati, Cole Miller, Sinclair Community College, Annalise Mills, Palm Beach Atlantic University, Taylor Newland, Sinclair Community College, Isabel Nixon, Ohio State University, Kayla Ogburn, Taylor University, Emmeline Perkey, Sinclair, I'm sorry, Cedarville University, Bailey Peterson, Ohio State University, Madison Pullen, Wright State University, Martina Pullen, University of Toledo, Samuel Reynolds, University of Dayton, Charles Rice, Sinclair Community College, Julie Sane, Miami Valley CTC, Jenna Schubert, Liberty University, Jose Josefina Skolik, Liberty University, 
Rebecca Scugins, Miami University, Oxford, and Adeline Smith, Lee University. Please give them applause. Three other graduates in this list include Caleb Stark, Ohio State University, Lima Campus, Darren Swift, Ohio State University, and Silas Thompson, Liberty University. Please give them a round of applause. Each year, Dayton Christian chooses one senior who exemplifies a good citizen for the Daughters of the American Revolution Good Citizen Scholarship. This student must submit an application, including an essay that pertains to American patriotism. This year, Samuel Reynolds was chosen for this honor. We will now recognize the seniors who have had all A's or B's for the entire four years. Please come forward and receive a certificate and a special award. Zoe Adams, Brianna Blake, Jerry Chen, Nyla Clements, Karina Collier, Lauren Collins, Sia Cron, Sophia Cron, Cameron Dudley, Aaron Ebert, Maria Fleetwood, Holly Garrett, Nathaniel Geis, Sophia Graham, Alex Heinrich, Zai Holiday, Caitlin Horton, Elijah Joyce, Elena Miller, Maddie Pullen, Martina Pullen, Addie Smith, and Silas Thompson. At this time, we'll present the All A's Honor Roll for all four years in high school. First up, William Cron. Next, Julia Hahn. Sam Reynolds. And Chloe Dickerson. Next, we have students achieving a 4.0 cumulative GPA throughout their high school career. Julia Broughton, James Broughton, Faith Conover, Isabel Nixon, Kayla Ogburn, and Josephina Skolik. Today we would also like to recognize our junior honor guard. These are the top six academic ranked students in the junior class and they will be representing their junior class as they welcome the graduates of the class of 2021 into their baccalaureate and onto the stage at graduation. Our first honor guard member is Rhett Bailey. <laughs> junior honor guard member Caitlin Halter. Junior Honor Guard member Sam Hendricks. Junior Honor Guard member Kaylee Redman. Junior Honor Guard member Avi Sakti Kumaran. And Junior Honor Guard member Isabel Thompson. We're now going to recognize the top six 
achieving students in the senior class. We have two salutatorians, Eleanor McDaniel and Isabel Nixon. Mm. Mm -hmm. We normally have three valedictorians and three salutatorians, but this year we had a very close race and we had a tie for our valedictorians, so we have four. Sia Cron, yeah. <laughs> Sophia Cron, yeah. Julia Hahn, yeah. and Sam Reynolds. I'm going to ask Mr. Malmstrom to please come up and close us in prayer. All right. All right, bow your heads and pray with me. Lord, thank you for an opportunity this morning to recognize the great achievements um, in our student body. We're specifically excited for the senior class as they prepare for the next season of their lives going off to many different universities. Um, we just pray that you would give them wisdom and guidance as they make decisions over these next um, several weeks, and uh, thank you for all of the work that they've put in. We cannot say thank you enough, and we're just very excited for them. Help us all to finish well here uh, in the high school, and um, we just pray for your guidance and for your wisdom um, as we close out this school year. It's in your name we pray. Amen. All right, guys, if you wouldn't mind, uh, I need Mr. Belunka's, uh study hall to 